The West Point History of Warfare is a 71 chapter, million word, interactive military history digital textbook currently used by 1,100 cadets a year. It represents a significant milestone in classroom pedagogy. The book leverages the latest advances in digital publishing to successfully balance the breadth, depth, and context of its subject matter. The cartography in the West Point History of Warfare is second to none. The book features hundreds of animated maps that cover the strategic, operational, and tactical levels of war. These animated maps include stops at key moments, highlighting the important decisions and shifts in the action. New research allows us to account for units and their movement, not just relative to the battlefield, but to one another across time. These keyframes then become not just individual moments, but opportunities to discuss the impact of simultaneous action and the limitations of knowledge at a particular moment. The layering of information in the chapter timelines allows students to better understand the relationship between space and time of events. This also allows the instructor to have more effective conversations about the differences between correlation and causation. Layering is not limited to dates and events, but also includes data that further illustrates the changing relationship between people, places, and time. Hot spotting allows the user to explore history's most famous works of art and more fully appreciate the intricate design and editorial decisions the artist made. This same function can be used to help better explain complex political cartoons to the user. This aids in the understanding of the image and makes it more than just a neat picture. The book features dozens of custom illustrations specifically commissioned by West Point and edited by historians. The soldier widgets allow the reader to get a feel for the life of the average soldier on the battlefield and on campaign. Tactics widgets examine the micro-level details of how history's military and naval forces have fought each other over time. Every interactive set was specifically designed not for the purpose of interesting the antiquarian, but rather to support higher-level pedagogical ideals. The widgets allow for the quick dissemination of complex ideas, allowing the instructor to devote class time to more intellectual discourse while still grounding the student in the historical context of the time period. The widgets also speak to each other across the breadth of the book allowing for the student and instructor to better explore the social, cultural, and technological changes that influenced history.
the West Point History of Warfare's first-person accounts of battle, both textual and audiovisual, provide the classroom with the smell of gunpowder and allow the past a chance to speak for itself. Someone said to us excitedly, Jack Smith. I said, what about him? I knew Jack Smith. He's dead. He's been shot. The first one of the battalion to be shot. I said, what? Yes, he's dead. He's been shot. He put his head too far over and a sniper got him. And that caused a bit of a sensation amongst the, the lads. They thought, well, uh, this is not exactly what we come for kind of business. Interactive data visualizations help the student explore large quantities of information in a convenient format, capable of being used directly in the classroom in a time-efficient manner. The entire book features a fully functioning footnote section that, whenever possible, links the reader to hyperlinked primary sources publicly available on the internet. The student has the ability to take notes directly in the text of the book. This can be used to generate flashcards as a study aid and help the reader reinforce the learning points of the text. The guiding principle behind the West Point History of Warfare was to create a project that could increase the knowledge base of novice learners and subject matter experts alike. By leveraging the tools of digital publishing, we believe that we have designed a tool that helps new students better understand and apply the lessons of the past. At the same time, more experienced users can analyze and evaluate the material in a deeper, more efficient way than ever before.